When we talk about advertising, the fuselage of the airplane is the best billboard for airlines. In today's video, we reveal 22 eye-catching airplane paint jobs that turned heads. Number 22. Skymark Airlines Pikachu Plane Your favorite Pokemon character Pikachu is featured on Skymark Airlines Jet BC-1. Skymark Airlines has collaborated with Pokemon Corporation and had painted a total of 10 Pikachus on both left and right side of the aircraft. Each Pikachu is carrying colorful balloons. Fun fact, there is one Pikachu hidden under the belly of the airplane. So when this airplane flies over you, keep an eye for this special Pikachu. Number 21. Thomas Cook, Kamagurka Airlines Plane Thomas Cook Airlines always has its way in surprising aviation geeks with weird liveries. But this long-haired character is definitely the weirdest. When the airline turned 5 years old, it painted one of its Airbus 320 aircraft with a comedian famous cartoon character known as Kamagurka. Kamagurka is a long-haired superhero and was laid across most of the fuselage with her long hair above the windows. Number 20. LATAM Stormtrooper Plane This South American airline has Star Wars painted on its Boeing 777-300ER fuselage. The livery was designed by Disney's team, along with Lucasfilm, to promote new Disney Studios attraction, Star Wars Galaxy's Edge. The painting took 21 days to complete and almost 2,500 liters of paint. If you ever flew on LATAM's Star Wars plane, you will be able to watch Star Wars Saga offered by the airline using its streaming service on board. Number 19. Kalula Air Flying 101 Plane This South African low-cost airline has a good sense of humor when it does paint jobs. Flying 101, Boeing 737-800 airplane, was designed by the airline's in-house design team. The aircraft has white arrows running throughout its body to identify obvious parts of the aircraft in bold white. These labels are also accompanied by comical comments. For example, the emergency exits have a throne zone comment to justify the extra leg room in this location, and the avionics section have a fancy navigation stuff comment. Features which are not visible to the outside are labeled in dotted lines like the passenger seats, toilets, and the galley. The galley is represented by a cup of coffee using dotted lines. Quite creative, Kalula. Number 18. Garuda Airline Mask Livery The Indonesian airline painted masks on its planes to support the COVID-19 government regulations in Indonesia. Garuda Airlines has painted a face mask on the nose of an Airbus 330-900neo. They used light blue color to resemble the color of actual face masks. Nearly 120 man-hours were used to paint the masks on the five Airbus 330-900neos. Number 17. Transaero, a Moor Tiger Plane This airline painted the nose of a Boeing 747 aircraft with the face of a big, yet vulnerable Amur Tiger. The Amur Tiger is the largest of the five tiger species, and Russia launched a special strategy to protect this endangered animal. The project was a combined effort between Transaero Airlines and the Amur Tiger Center to draw attention to the endangered species of Amur Tigers. The face of the tiger was created using a mix of nine different colors and four principal colors. The paint design took 12 days to complete. To record this remarkable creation, the Russian airline invited a special filming crew to record this special livery coming to life. Passengers on board were given the opportunity to watch documentaries prepared by the Amur Tiger Center for maximum attention. The interior of the plane also had sections covered in orange with a tiger theme. Number 16. Alaska Airlines Salmon 30 Salmon Livery The Alaskan airline uses the fuselage of Boeing 737, Salmon 30 Salmon, get it? To showcase salmon fish as its distinguishable livery. It is believed that the design was inspired by a salmon fish dropped on an Alaskan airline plane by a passing eagle as the plane was taking off from Juneau, Alaska. Number 15. Emirates Airline Arsenal Livery this Emirates Airbus A380 airplane was painted with Arsenal Football Club crest, and it features Lucas Tojeda, Mesut Ozil, Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang, Henrik Mkhitaryan, and Alexandra Lacazette, Arsenal's first team players. The design supported the official inauguration of Al Maktoum Stadium on 26 March 2019. The painting covers an area of 383 square meters, and the players are visible from both ground and air. Number 14. Air New Zealand Hobbit-themed plane Since the Hobbit trilogy was filmed entirely in New Zealand, the country's national carrier decided to transform the fuselage of a Boeing 777-300ER into a huge flying billboard announcing the release of the movie. The Hobbit, the desolation of smog. The airplane also flew to the movie's premiere. The Dragon's logo is 54 meters high and spans across both sides of the aircraft. 
This marketing move was aimed to benefiting both the movie and the airline, and it was the third time New Zealand features The Hobbit or Lord of the Rings saga on its aircraft. Number 13. WestJet Disney Frozen-themed plane Canadian WestJet Airline created the cold-to-warm scene in the Disney movie Frozen on its Boeing 737 airplane using 170 gallons of paint to feature Anna, Elsa, and Olaf, the main characters from the Disney movie. The crew spent 21 days of continuous 12-hour shifts to complete the paint job. The paint team watched Frozen to inspire them before they started painting the aircraft. 23 distinct colors were used including sparkles and glitter. Even the interior of the aircraft is Frozen-themed, with headrest covers that resembles the cold-to-warm theme on the outside of the plane. Number 12. Hainan Airlines Kung Fu Panda Livery This Boeing 787-9 Dreamliner is the third of its nature in the Hainan Airlines, a Chinese-based airline. The design includes popular characters such as Poe and Tigress, alongside traditional Chinese chops and a sunrise. During the aircraft inaugural flight, Hannah Foss, the Alaskan designer of the Kung Fu Panda livery, was chosen to travel on board the Dreamliner with a round-trip business class ticket to China, along with one week's stay in a luxury hotel in town. Her design was chosen among many others and submitted to Hainan Airline during the airline livery competition in 2017. Number 11. Concorde and the Pepsi Livery Concorde was painted blue, red, and white for just two weeks in 1996. Air France collaborated with Pepsi in a promotional campaign when Pepsi was rebranding its product to the new colors we know today. The marketing project costed $500 million. Pepsi approached both operators of the Concorde, British Airways, and Air France, but only Air France agreed to accept the promotional deal and for only two weeks. Since the Concorde was a supersonic aircraft, its fuselage was painted with highly reflective white paint to deflect some heat. But with the blue Pepsi color, this was not possible. So the chosen Air France plane was restricted to flying at Mach 2 for 20 minutes at a time. Number 10. Qantas Emily Came Kingwari Plane This unique painting was transformed from a canvas to the actual body of a Boeing 737-9 in the Qantas fleet. It is inspired by the 1991 artwork, Yam Dreaming, by the internationally renowned artist Emily Came Kingwari, after which the airplane was named. The painting represents the yam plant and its essence. It took more than 10 days and 60 designers, engineers, and painters to work on the design. Qantas uses this aircraft along with four others to represent its Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander art and is proud of it. Fun fact, there are approximately 5,000 dots on the airplane. Number 9. Alaska Airlines Mickey Mouse Livery The exterior of the Spirit of Disneyland 2 aircraft includes recognizable faces of Mickey and Minnie Mouse, Donald Duck, Goofy, and for the first time, Pluto. Alaska Airlines is not new to Disney-themed liveries. Indeed, the Spirit of Disneyland 2 is the fourth of three other Disney-themed planes in the Alaskan Airlines fleet. The airline made its first flight from Portland to Los Angeles, carrying three Make-A-Wish Foundation children to Disneyland to grant them their wishes. This would not have been possible without the partnership between Alaskan Airlines, Disney, and Make-A-Wish Foundation. Number 8. Nock Air Bird Livery Nock translates to bird in Thai. As the name suggests, the Thai airline uses several liveries on its Boeing 737 aircraft to represent one identifiable design of a bird. The bird beak is always at the nose of the airplane and the windows look like sunshades for the bird. Nock Air was initially known as Sky Asia before changing its brand name to Nock Air. Is it a bird? Is it a plane? Nock Air gave us the answer already. It's a bird. Number 7. Iceland Air, Northern Lights Livery. Iceland Air represents the magnificent Aurora Borealis on its Hecla Aurora airplane, a Boeing 757. The intention of the airline is to promote stopovers at Iceland to enjoy the fabulous Northern Lights on their way from Europe to North America. The interior of the Hecla Aurora cabin is fitted with LED mood lighting system that displays the colors of the Northern Lights giving the same magical feeling of being there. Hekla is a famous Icelandic girl's name and a famous volcano in Iceland. Aurora represents the Northern Lights. Number 6. Brussels Airlines Tintin Livery If you are a fan of the Tintin album, Red Rackham's Treasure, then you will probably fall in love with this fabulous Airbus 320. The paint design takes the form of a shark submarine from the Tintin adventure. Since Tintin is a Brussels-born character, Brussels Airlines takes pride in collaborating with Mulan's Art, the company that promotes the work of Hergé the creator of Tintin, to bring this unique, first-of-its-kind livery to the fuselage of an Airbus A320. The album Red Rackham's Treasure is available for reading on board in Dutch, French, and English languages. Number 5. Azor Airlines Sperm Whale Livery 
Azores Airlines, a Portuguese airline, designed the fuselage of an Airbus 300-200 with the unique, vulnerable mammal, the sperm whale. Sperm whales are seen year-round in the Azores. To stop sperm whales hunting, Azor Airlines transformed its livery into a blue sperm whale spread on the fuselage. The airline also carries passengers to the Azores to see the sperm whales and the sanctuaries where they are normally located. Number 4. British Airways Fashion Livery This British Airways Boeing 777-200 airplane livery was designed by the famous Chinese fashion designer Ma Sha Ma. The airline unveiled this special livery in the 2015 Great Festival of Creativity in Shanghai. The design depicts a bamboo and a rose to represent an East meets West fusion by representing European artistic techniques and Chinese ink and wash painting. The design took 2,472 man hours and 186 individual stencils to apply. Number 3. Eva Air, Gudetama Livery. Eva Air, a Taiwanese airline, has partnered with Sanrio to bring together six different Sanrio themed aircraft to the airline's fleet, just like all Nippon Airways. Eva Air is fascinated with cartoons. However, the Lazy Egg, Gudetama, is a unique Airbus 321-200 livery. The concept behind flying on the Gudetama airplane is to escape the tedious life and enjoy a relaxed, lazy style of travel. Gudetama is the latest addition to the five other Sanrio-themed airplanes. Number 2. Anna Panda Livery All Nippon Airlines transformed the fuselage of a Boeing 767 aircraft to a huge panda-themed livery. In celebration of 20 years' flight between Japan and China, as well as the 35 years of diplomatic relations between the two countries. The design involved 350 people and 80 hours to paint it onto the fuselage of the aircraft. Number 1. Emirates Airline Year of Tolerance Plane Emirates Airline represented the theme of the Year of Tolerance with a painting of people of different nationalities holding hands to represent UAE's message of diversity and multiculturalism. The Airbus A380 entered the World Guinness record as it was welcomed 145 nationalities on board Flight EK 2019 while celebrating its 48th UAE National Day and the Year of Tolerance. The plane was carrying 500 passengers on board and flew over the seven emirates on low altitude to allow people on ground to watch the special masterpiece. Many passengers wore their national dresses to represent their country on this special flight. Let us know which of the designs you love the most and whether you would like to see part two of this series. Do not forget to like, share, and subscribe. See you in the next one.